This past weekend was what we call Vision Weekend at Mech, which falls around the anniversary of the church each year. This year marks our 32nd anniversary, and Pastor Jim, who is the founding and senior pastor of Mech, shared with us the history of when the church got started, carrying us all the way through today and the vision for the coming years. He shared a lot of statistics and year-over-year -year breakdowns. If you did not get a chance to hear it all, I hope you'll go back and listen to it or watch it on Mech's website, app, or the Mech's YouTube channel. One thing he focused on was that it is not really normal for churches to be growing the way that Mech has been growing. There are many churches that have plateaued and quite a few honestly did not survive the pandemic, all of which is truly disheartening. Mech's mission, which is the same mission Jesus had, is to see those who are far from God enter into a life-changing relationship with Him. So if a church is not growing, then that means that there aren't people who are learning about Jesus and then entering into a relationship with Him. That's why it's so encouraging to hear Pastor Jim talk about all the ways that Mech is growing. And I am so happy to be a part of a community of believers that is adding to their numbers daily. In the book of Acts in the New Testament of the Bible, where the acts of the early church are recorded, we're told that a church should look like and what a church should do. That is where Mech has gotten its core values from. It is where we have faithfully ran all tactics and strategies through. It is where we can understand that a Christian church what it was meant to look like. Here is what it says. They devoted themselves to the apostles' teaching and, fel and to fellowship, to the breaking of bread and prayer. Everyone was filled with awe at the many wonders and signs performed by the apostles. All the believers were together and had everything in common. They sold property and possessions to give to anyone who had need. Every day they continued to meet together in the temple courts. They broke bread in their homes and ate together with glad and sincere hearts, praising God and enjoying the favor of all the people. And the Lord added to their number daily those who were being saved. In other words, a church that looks like this needs to be a learning church, a loving church, a gathering church, a giving church, and a reaching church. Meg is a learning church. Pastor Jim is ruthless in his continued study and keeping up with culture. He never shies away from controversial topics. Mech offers the Mech Institute, where you can continue to learn on your own time and with others. These daily devos that you're listening to right now can help you dig deeper into what you hear on the weekend. The list goes on. Mech is a loving church, a community that truly accepts all people where they are in life a place where it is completely safe to ask all your questions and to explore Christianity with no strings attached. We're confident that if you ask difficult questions and get answers delivered in love, that no matter where you are in life, you'll want to hear more about Jesus and grow closer with Him. Mech is a gathering church. Every weekend, in person and online, weekdays for students, group gatherings outside of service times, a coffee shop open on weekdays for meetups and meetings, it's just a welcoming place to be. Mech is a giving church. Holy moly, Mech is a giving church that all comes from your generosity. The people of Mech have given so much out of their goodness of their hearts that last Monday, we were able to give a $25,000 gift right away to Samaritans First, headquartered in Boone, North Carolina for the relief efforts of Hurricane Helene and another $10,000 for Second Harvest Food Bank and the Metrolinas and their emergency food distribution efforts. And it won't stop there. We have mission partners in Charlotte, locally and all over the world that MEC gets to support with giving their time and resources through our missions teams as well as through financial support. And MEC is a reaching church. Our whole mission is to reach people who don't have a relationship with God. Everything we do as a church is put through the lens of someone who doesn't believe in God. We do things purposefully and intentionally to help people understand, know, and love God. Because again, we're confident that if we, if we get them to Mech and if they get to hear about God without any judgment for where they're at in life or have been, then they'll keep coming back. And that's just not because of anything we did. It's because of what God is doing. So if you're a part of Mech, thank you. Thank you for helping grow this church and keep it functioning the way God intended a church to function. And if you haven't been to Mech, well, I invite you to join us this weekend. We have services in person on Sunday mornings and online pretty much all day Sunday with two extra on Tuesdays. So don't take my word for it and see it for yourself.